This video is going to quickly show you how to make a chart and a trend line and a y equals mx plus b equation using Google Sheets. To begin with, I've got my data already entered over here, including the header at the top, which says distance and time. So I'll click on distance, and then I'm going to highlight down to 9. So I'm going to hold the shift key and just click on 9, or you can drag down there, and then choose insert and chart. If your graph doesn't look like this, uh, chances are good that over here on the right hand side you didn't, don't have st uh, scatter chart selected. So make sure you select the scatter chart. I'll move this over a little bit. All right. Now, to get the trend line, I'll get go to customize on the right hand side, top right. So click there. And then what I'm going to do is the series. Go down to where it says trend line. I'll click on trend line. Then I'll keep scrolling down again where it says label and it says none right now. I'm going to change that to use equation. And then I'll show you an R squared. So this is how good of a fit the whole thing is. And there we go. It's all done. If you want to dress it up a little bit, you can go to the legend. And where it says auto right now. And I'm just going to put it on the right hand side. So here's my equation. It says equals one half times x plus zero. And then R squared equals one. But what that means is that time over here on the left, see where it says time up there at the top of it, time equals 0.5 times x, which is distance, plus 0. And the regression coefficient squared is equal to 1. r squared equals 1 is not part of the equation for a straight line.